Speaking of Joe Biden, this video today is brought to you by Equate Daily Fiber. Joe Biden recommends you take six to 18 capsules a day and you will be regular. And you will have no problem shitting or shitting your pants. That's like, why uh, I wear adult diapers. Jerry Nadler did not take these and he shit his pants during a Congress uh, meeting. So take Wait, your fiber, kids. Don't those make you shit? Well, this is Facilium Husk. This bulks. And you don't necessarily shit your pants. It comes out f formed. <laughs> what what kind of form? <laughs> Poop form. <laughs> I'm lactose intolerant, so I have to like take all kinds of stupid shit if I want to like be able to eat and drink milk. I have to take like uh. Do you often lopramide? Do you and, often eat milk? Well, I never eat milk. I eat forms of milk, dairy, cheddar, you know. Uh, but anyway, so yeah, it's, it sucks. <laughs> I wouldn't rec recommend being lactose intolerant. I wouldn't intolerant. recommend being lactose intolerant. Which, you know what else sucks? Celiac disease. Why would you do that? Oh, what is that? <laughs> it's when you have... I know a, a little bit about it. Your gluten allergy. Like the legit gluten allergy. Yeah, not like the people. I think I'm intolerant to gluten. Well, I think... Not to get off topic. I think... A lot of been, people are. I think there's been a false, uh, a false equivalency on the inflammatory properties of eating uh, bread... Versus an actual intolerance to gluten. Yeah, because, I mean, I'm just going to point this out there, but, you know, Subway is the only freaking place that tells you to eat a whole damn loaf of bread for dinner. You know, when uh, back in the day you were, you know, I'm going to say Jesus' time or whoever's time. Jerry's time. Jerry's time. Oh, Jared, not Jerry. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus and Jerry. Uh, You know, it's like Ben and Jerry's. Jesus and Jerry. That sounds like holy a terrible ice cream. <laughs> But, no, they, uh, you know, they had, like, a little bit of bread and then, you know, ate their other food. I, it sounds extremely stupid right now. But, anyway, so I, my point, I did not take a gummy. I'm just, my brain's fried. I've been dealing with crazy kids. Um, you know, like, I, I don't I don't get why. We do eat a lot of bread. Oh, yeah, we eat a ton. Bread and corn. It's in everything. <clears throat> corn. Soy, too. Soy's, yeah, but soy's corn, really bad for you. I mean, corn's in everything. Soy's especially bad for men. Men and <laughs> well, no, because apparently I just I just learned this. If um, a lot of uh, if you ingest a lot of soy in your everyday diet, <clears throat> it can actually boost your estrogen in in men. Oh, it'll give you titties. Well, no, what it does is it makes you see when your when your um, estrogen levels go up, your testosterone automatically goes down. That's why many people are soy boys. Now they're uh, well, that's a lot of people. Terms, are I didn't know this. That's where boy. the term soy boy comes from. Yeah. And, and a lot of uh, – you saw that with Joe Rogan, didn't you? Which one? I, I don't even freaking know. I've watched so many. I, I remember them talking about Soy Boy, and the uh, dude was like, I always took that as an, off as an offense. I and uh, And Joe just like – I can't remember if it was for or against it. I can't remember. But he was basically saying soy is not good for you. Actually, I remember now. It was the uh, the meat eater. Yeah, um, the carnivore uh, guy at diet. Carnivore diet. diet. And Joe, Joe's back on the carnivore diet. Again. I thought it was – there was a – I want to say it was one he did with Deborah So, but there was this hilarious bit where he's like, I forget who they were talking about, but they're basically talking about like beta guys, and one guy in particular, and he was like, I bet he's got a ball gag in right now. Like, yes, mistress. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, oh my god, that's hilarious. I remember the joke. I can't remember which one. Oh my gosh! Everybody who's watching, I was like, we're supposed to be talking about the riots. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm, we're getting back there.